Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. You have found Brutuski Gaming. Today in Scrap Mechanic, I downloaded a whole bunch of mods so I could try to get some of your guys' creations in so we could take a look at them, see what they were, how they worked, etc. One of the things that I found in the mods was this dude. He's like super creepy and stalkerish and just kind of follows me around. It's kind of strange. You can't hide from him. You can't. He just knows you're there. I wonder if I go really far away if you can still see me. Oh, oh, it doesn't look like it. Okay, cool. Yep, that's about where you can see you at. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Like I said, I went ahead and downloaded a whole bunch of mods into this game. Because some of this stuff is insanity. Uh, we got a lot to get through, so I'm going to get started and probably be pretty quick on each one. We've got Swaja's G Wagon Win. I'm sure I slaughtered that completely, but it has no description. It's by Lou. So, spawn this thing in here. What is going on? How come I can't move? There it goes. Pull this thing off lift. That was way too close to that, but oh well. Go up here and hop in the seat. Buttons galore. Alright, zoom out. Good, we're good. Number one. Oh, we better pull off there. Opens the back door. Okay. Number two is boost. Number three. Lights. Number four. I don't see or hear anything for number four. Oh, I see. <laughs> I think I just figured out number four. Number four looks like it shoots out a rope from the back and hooks it onto whatever's close. Number five winches you in. Number six lets it out slowly. Number seven. Um, six and seven both let it out? Yep, yeah, they do. And that's all it's got. Alright, how do you unhook, I wonder? Because I want to unhook this now. Four, maybe? No, two. Two unhooks it all. So two is boost and unhook? Okay, wow, this thing is something else. That suspension under there, I don't even know what it's doing right now. Like, what? Almost looks like the whole axles are turning. Or it's just got four-wheel steering, so it's set up way too responsive. I can see that, too. Two, let's go. It's really stable, though. I do got to give it that. As much as it leans and it tips and it goes all over the place, it does not flip. Which is super cool. Super impressed with that with this guy. All right, we're going to hop out of that. Hop into the next one real quick. I don't expect to get many of these in here before I have to use the destroyer over there. Uh, what's this button do? Nothing. Okay. Hop in the seat. Number one. Okay. Number two. Okay. Three. Doesn't seem to do anything at the moment. Four. Five, six, nothing. W, A, S, D. Okay, that's not doing anything. W, two, three, five, seven. Yeah, this doesn't do anything. What? Is it upside down? Is that what's going on? No, because W, A, S, D does nothing. It doesn't turn or... Move. I'm not on a lift, am I? Oh, I feel silly now. I was on a lift the whole time. That's probably a door. Oh, man. Let's try this again. So, number one, turns on all your thrusters. Number two, 
rolls up your door, number three, puts up the sunroof, four goes backwards, five transforms into a rock. But it actually drives now, so it's a good rock. Five, go put those wheels back out. Let's see what they do for us. Oh, that's a wall. That's a wall. No, 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 no. Come on, fall down. Alright, we're going to have to put this under here. And push it back over. There we go. I'm just going to jump up on this guy. Maybe not. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, that's a wall still. Back up. Ooh, it does not have reverse. Oh, that's not good. Well, looks like we're done with this one. Stuck on a wall. Alright. Next one up. I'm going to do this airplane here. And this will probably be the last one before it legs the game out. This might actually leg the game out really bad. But we'll give it a shot. Yeah, that looks about right. Yep, right in line. Actually, it's not as bad as I thought it would be, honestly. Wait, what? Why is the back on the ground? Alright, let's walk up and go ahead and end this thing. Any way to get into it back here? Doesn't look like it. This door, maybe? Hopefully, we can get in here. Because this does not look promising, honestly. Alright, we're in. Let's see which one everything's hooked up to. This one over here. Alright. Number one is thrust. Number two, what, number nine. Eight, seven, all right, we're stuck on that. There we go, now we should be fine to do that. Number nine is to taxi, looks like, so we're going right back down to the ground with it. Turn one off, see what it does. Oh, and it actually turns. That is cool. Number one brings the nose up. Two. Okay. Kind of looking around, making sure I'm doing everything right here. Number nine, we're going to turn you on. Get this guy up in the air. Hopefully. Yeah, that is a lot of thrusters, too. Holy cow. Oh, there's landing gear. Put them back away. We don't need you guys out. Thank you. Eight opens that door. Seven closes that door. That is cool. This thing is huge and really hard to control. But, it's not that bad, all things considered. I mean, it is turning for me. Which is a huge deal. I'm usually not this good at flying anything. Let's see if we can't get it to go back over toward... Nope. We're going to land on our top. That's what's going to happen. Alright, I'm hopping out.
What are the wings doing? Alright. Let's... Ooh, I got bad leg too. Hopefully we got something in here I can drive. Yeah, let's do this dude. Real motocross. I just realized that I have not been telling anybody what any of this stuff is. Alright, try this again. Go back in here. I told that one. This one here was by the white mask. That upside down car thing. Left hand says 370 or 737. By phone turnip. Now... Free one real motocross by Lou as well. Oh, that was cool looking. Get this guy back over. Oh, what? It's got one wheel. How is... What? How does he have it working on one wheel? Like... I mean, it's super cool. I gotta give him that. Single tire motocross creation? That is... Monowheel? Yeah, definitely a monowheel. And it's pretty fast, seems like, anyway. Get over here and we'll kick on our black hole gun and... Blow all this up. But yeah, this thing's pretty cool. One button. This is not connected to anything. So, there's that. Alright, I'm going to hop out here. Oh, that thing stops fast, too. Holy cow. Was definitely not expecting that. Alright, so we're going to go in here. Kick you on. kick you on and hope for the best. Oh yeah, we're good. Oh, the leg. Come on, let's get some of this stuff to start blowing up. Before that thing decides to start dragging over. Oh, the leg is real. Holy cow. Come on, blow something up. Finally, holy cow. Now we're blowing up. There it goes. Jeez, that took forever to get going. And my guinea pig says hello to everybody. I don't know why he's upset. He's got food, water, just had some donuts, so he's plenty spoiled. All right, come on, let's get this cleaned up. Good thing that thing's not coming over yet. Actually, I wonder if I can't swing this over. Shoot you. Oh, no. There it goes. Not sure why we're so leggy right now. Unless it's just that thing over there. No, come back. Okay, so I thought that if I ran over and corrected this guy, was able to bring him back, that it'd be a good thing. But apparently he's just going to fly into the wormhole over there without me and... Yeah, so now we gotta wait. Yep, he's up in the wormhole now. Look at him go. One thing I do gotta say is it does fly really well when it's in a wormhole or a black hole. 
It's nice and level. It's just kind of floating around. Super cool creation. Now I just got to get over here to turn on the bomb so I can destroy it like it destroys my frame rate. Hopefully. Hopefully I've got enough frames that it'll actually blow up for me and not stall out or anything weird. Like what happened when last time I turned this thing on and it's, all the bombs flew out and bounced into stuff. They just didn't actually explode anything. Alright, let's do this. Here we go. Oh yeah, that is much better. Yeah, blow him up. We don't like that big plane. It takes up too many frames. Wow, it's getting lucky and not catching any of these bombs yet. But it's going to happen. You watch. There it is. Oh, that was a good hit, too. Wow. Look at how many frames we got back from that one piece getting blown off. Now it's got to think about all the bombs, so it's legging out again. There we go. Oh, yeah. Just complete and total annihilation right there. Oh, no. We got hit with a bomb, guys. We got hit with a bomb. That's all right. I don't like this guy anyway. Go away. Nice. What? Didn't blow him up? Unacceptable. All right. Let me get another one of these spawned in real quick. I'll try to clean up this map a little bit. That's new and odd. But I'll go with it. I mean, not that I have much of a choice at this point. I'm just not sure why there's an explosive attached to the seat. Or maybe it's attached to those... Or maybe it's just sitting there. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, now it's blowing stuff up. Much, much faster. Much better frame rate. This is what I'm talking about. Alright, I think that's enough for us right now. Go ahead and start on the next creation. I think we're going to end on my last creation ever by Kimo Effendi. Now he said he is completely done. He has given up the ship after however long he's been doing this. He said it's been years, so... I said, I thought he said that there was a button. There's not a button. It's, it's literally just a duck that spins. Wow. Way to go out with a bang there, buddy. What is it, a sensor down here? No. Logic 8. Alright, I can't end on that note. That was a lot less than I thought it was going to be, honestly. I thought it'd be a lot cooler. Um, I guess we can do the Cybertruck theme. Cause he's got a Cybertruck here. And these are all by Ghetto Life, by the way. Cause he's got that, he's got the four-wheeler, and he's got the trailer that goes with it. Now, if I remember right, all this stuff welds together somehow. So I'm going to do that. Get this welded onto this. Um, where is it supposed to connect to? Oh, right there. Beautiful. Alright, let's take a look at this stuff. We've got a trailer, obviously. Let's see how big it is inside. Oh, that's cool. That opened really cool. That. Wow. I say that was impressive. I don't think I've ever seen anybody go through that much to open a door. Definitely an A for effort. Go ahead and hop on this little dude here and see. 
Um, I think I'm in the wrong seat. There it goes. Number one turns your lights on and off. Wow, this thing is slow. That's what I get out of this. This is slow. And for real, that, that's all it's got. And then I've got a button for lights. That's it. Okay, that kind of sucked. Hopefully this is better. Pop up into here. Okay. Um, you close back up lights. Oh, door. All right, there we go. Now let's see how fast this thing is. Keep in mind, this thing does have a pretty decently sized trailer behind it, so... Oh, it seems to be pulling really nice. Like, really nice. Holy cow. Heck yeah. So, number one opens that thing up. Number two is for lights, and that's really all it's got. I'm going to have that open up on us, though. Pull this up. Am I out of it? Nope, I'm trapped. I gotta try to untrap myself. It's one thing I don't like about some of these builds, mine included, is that you get trapped inside of them, and that sucks. No one wants to be trapped inside of your creations. I don't want to be trapped inside of my own creations. Go ahead and turn that bad boy on and get this guy going right away, and... Let's blow all that stuff up. See how it blows up. There's a lot of bombs out right now. Come on. Explode on impact, somebody. Come on. Oh, there it is. Boom! That was... Wow. The fireworks were cool there. Holy cow. Oh, yeah. I think I'm going to leave you with that. This nice little tornado of explosives and random pieces of the things we had spawned in earlier. Um, and that's going to do it for us today. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe for additional content. Let me know in the comments what was your favorite creation of this bunch. And this has been Drew Tuska Gaming. And I'll see you next time.